and welcome back to our Let's Play on the Ark. We're on the Aberration map. And we're chasing a parasaur. So we need some meat. And we need hides. Lots and lots of hides. Plus it helps us level up. And we're going to have to make a Diplo saddle and all kinds of stuff. So the more we can get the better. What I really need is some new tools. Oh, Look here. Do you see that mushroom right there with the little triangle top and a little red on the bottom? Those stay away from them. These are safe. These little round ones with the white bottoms, they're fine. But stay away from those triangle guys. Because they will trip you out. <laughs> Alright, see? I put up some the fencing and everything like that and spike walls and I want to put up some more because I want to be able to run in but if, if anything is following me I don't want it to to catch me and get stuck on it so yeah watch this ha look what I made these are um portable lights they're really cool and um, just get them on your engram and make one and they're really cool they give off this red glow and the cool thing is um, I didn't find this out till later on my other series that you can actually color them any color you want that you can make dyes or whatever so we'll put some of those in the storage and I made uh, a new life box so let's label that and that's in case I die, then I can easily come back. You know, it has extra spears and clothes and that sort of thing. What I'm really in need of, though, is water. We got to figure out a way to get down to the water without getting our butts killed. So, only one way to do it is kind of see what's out there. Best way to survive is to watch for stuff that's running. <laughs> you can make sure you run with them. My favorite saying in this game is you do not have to outrun the dinosaurs. You only have to run faster than your friends. Or in this case, the animals. So, Alright. I'm gathering some wood and supplies. Always, always, always thatch wood to build. Needed for burning, you know, to make food and all this kind of, I mean, you know, this is the basic stuff. There's the water. There's the water. And looks like there's a predator over there. I don't want to entangle him at all. So we can get some more wood. I'm getting a little overloaded, so I'm gonna be careful. Always keep frosty. Keep an eye out. There's a roll rat over there. You can harvest all these mushrooms. Um, yeah, so we figured out that the, the mushrooms, they're a good kind. And some are for eating, some are for water, some are for stimulant, some are for uh, narcotics. Okay, so I wanted to build a ramp. Here comes the earthquake. Free loot drop! Yay! Oh, this is an aggravating thing that this stupid... I hope they fix this. Is when if you have uh, a light source on your back that it will flop around in your face. And it's not cool. Not cool at all if you're doing anything like with your hands or whatever. See what I mean? Ugh. Oh well, we shall cope. I think you just use those kind of an emergency situation. I like being able to use my pet more, but I don't want to get, get. Uh oh. That 
is a scorpion. Looks like they tangled with the raw rat and got his ass kicked. Well, we'll take that. Thank you very much. Need the chitin. Make some cementing paste. Because eventually we're going to upgrade the house. Obviously, to stone. It helps level up. Okay. Oh, crap. Man, we be tripping. We be tripping. See what happens? You start kind of suffocating. Look at my health. Half. Quarter. You got to get out of it as quickly as possible. Or, you need to do something which I forgot, which is you can eat the aquatic mushrooms or the regular round mushrooms. Whichever one. I can't remember which one it is. But anyway, if you eat it, it will alleviate your symptoms right away. And if you eat them before you start harvesting mushrooms, then you don't have to worry about the symptoms at all. It, see that little protection number? It runs for about 30 seconds. To, depends on how many you eat. You could eat some of like the brown ones and some of the aquatic and um, a bunch of them. And then you can go and harvest as much as you want and you're protected from what just happened which was a psychedelic kind of mushroom trip that you go on if you run over that one I was telling you about okay oh, gathering resources in the beginning of the game it's like uh, yeah but you gotta level up so you know you can't just stand around and wait for it to come to you it just it doesn't That's where we came from. I'm thinking about, at some point, building like a perch. Oh, those green crystals. We'll get those later. I'm kind of nervous. It's the roll rat way. He's our friend, so I'm not going to aggravate him. He kicked that scorpion's butt. I'm trying to see what I can see. There's a drop over there, but we're nowhere near ready to go in the water and get a drop. Oh, what was that? Looks like a scorpion. More scorpions. Uh, what I'm scared of is maybe a rab. Get some more wood. Get the heebie jeebies. Okay, let's get this wood back. Oh! Crap! Get your stick. Run, 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 run. Run. You need some stimulant. So we don't pass out. Our torpor's going up really fast. Ow. Shoot. Oh no, I'm dehydrated too. Oh, and I passed out. Why? I don't know. Because my torpor was not... Oh no! Oh no! My little bob dog is fighting! He's gonna get his butt kicked! No! Oh no! Libby! Well, shh. And here I go. There goes my armor. How embarrassing. Death by scorpion. Well, 
Good thing I got that life box together. Crap. I'm sorry about my little Libby. Well, I have to get another one. Can't really go in this game without it. Yay for this. You see that green light? Yeah, that's your... Let me put all this in here. This, it's still going to be out there. Put my clothes on real quick. But since I died so close to the house, you know, I've got a little time so I can... Why did I forget pants? Alright, let's go back. We gotta reclaim our bag. I'm gonna get my stuff back. There it is. There it is. There it is. There it is. Run, run, run. Gotta get my stuff back. Ugh. Ah, I don't know where it went. It's probably back there fighting that Stego. Stego will kill it. I totally panicked. I should have stood there and fought with my spear, but I have no fortitude whatsoever, and that's the reason I passed out. So next time I think about it, I really need to... Oh, poor Libby. I need to. Oh my gosh, there's a Carno. Well, there's a gift. I gotta figure out though, where'd Libby go? Oh. Oh. I don't see it. I think that. I think that Stego might have killed it. I don't know. I need to empty out. I'm a little overloaded. Gosh, I can't believe that happened. But at least I got all my stuff back. But I'll ask my little Bob dog. Oh, there's my pants. Big goofus. Let's just get all this out. We can sort this later. Put our leather stuff back on. Although it's kind of busted up. It needs to be repaired a little bit. Totally busted my shoes. <sighs> okay, that's where my raw material is. And here's where I put my stuff. So Too many spears, but that's okay. Alright. Let's clean up out here. Poor Libby. She tried. She tried. Oh, there she is. That's her old rat. Okay. I don't want to attract any predators. We'll start with this in. There's three bodies to clean up. Be careful. Don't want to get any mushroom on me. Ooh, a lot of nice hide. Some prime. Some. Alright. Now we'll go get our own body. Like I said, you don't want to attract the predators. Oh, well. I know it's totally gross, but what are you going to do? I'll wait till he gets out of the way. Yay, cannibalism at its finest. Woohoo. Alright, let's go and we will 
I just don't see it. I guess it got killed. Yay, leveled up. Oh, poor Libby. Is this Libby? No, I don't think so. I think this is some random one. I don't know. I don't know if it was Libby, but anyway. <sighs> so, we gathered all the meat. I guess the the scorpion decomposed. It got killed because it would still be around. We're cooking on all the meat. Recycling. We'll call it recycling. <laughs> And there you have it. There you have it. The first death in aberration by stupid scorpion. And it's my own fault because I didn't have any points in fortitude. You have to have something because heat, cold, poison, you're, you know, like a newborn. You just are so susceptible. So. But now i got to make me a bed because I used my... my uh, sleeping bag and I want to have a permanent bed and I make it an S plus so I can pick it up and take it with us when we leave but I can't go anywhere until I get to the level where I can get a saddle I'm gonna go ahead and put the bed here so I'll have a place to respawn in case I get killed again and we'll have to go get us another bob dog or bulb dog or whatever they call them yeah, I'm going to rename this one the Rock Cabin Bed, and this is going to end this episode. I will talk to you later. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!